Hi folks, Max from Galaxy S4 Root.com for this week's GTI 9500, 9500 Prom of the Week. Check out the latest version of Android 4.4.4. Um, out of all the Android 4.4 ROMs that are out right now, I really like this one the best. Um, pretty, pretty stable, very stable. Uh, and you'll get the latest Android 4.4.4, obviously. Um, really like it. And uh, there is a ton of customization you can do. Um, some of the main stuff I really like is the home switcher. Uh, you can switch between three different launchers, as you can see here. And also, if you do install other launchers on the Play Store, you'll be able to switch easily. Um, pretty small feature, but it goes a long way. Um, definitely better than installing uh, any kind of um, home switcher apps, which can be kind of, um, they don't work. I mean, they work, but um, it's just more pain. And sometimes they have ads and uh, we don't like that. Um, dark stock, there we go. Um, that will make everything dark for you. All right. Uh, and also, let's go into Beanstalk options. You'll get all of these customizations. Uh, status bar, you'll be able to change the color of your signals, double tap to sleep, brightness control, all that good stuff, um, which is really nice. So you can easily do these kind of things. For those of you who don't know, um, notification and QS drawer. Um, you can go ahead and uh, add all of your favorite buttons here, all that good stuff. Uh, let's check out some of the buttons you can uh, add here. Um, let's check out some of these other ones. Uh, expanded desktop, uh, shake events, quick record, you can re uh, do screen recording. Um, also screenshot, where is screenshot? Um, for some reason that one's not here. All right. Uh, let's go take a look at some of the other options here. Alerts and warnings, um, display and animation. You can customize uh, your animations if you want to. Also, you, you'll find the exposed modules here uh, framework. Go ahead and hit install update if you're going to install the modules. Make sure you hit allow when the super user request pops up there. All right. And before you reboot, go to modules and enable any of your favorite uh, modules. You can go ahead and uh, Google expose modules and uh, get a bunch of different modules. Like there's a module for um, uh, allowing apps to run um, that check for root, such as banking apps. Um, you can install Root Cloak and uh, it'll show up here. Uh, there's a bunch of different modules, so check it out. And also, I do have a full tutorial guide for that uh, expose app settings, which will allow you to run uh, your favorite apps in custom DPI, tablets, all that good stuff. Uh, power menu, all right, you can go ahead and add screenshot here. There we go, so we found it. Also, screen recording here. Um, you can also add Pi controls if you want to. Gesture anywhere, that's awesome. Battery saver mode. Um, navigation bar, Pi controls, shake events, um, all this good stuff. You can have it on this ROM. Uh, everything working flawless. Of course, you probably want to check out the camera. Camera works very well. Uh, one of the highlights of um, this ROM. As you can see, Google camera working flawless with the video and also uh, captured during video. And also photo working great. Panorama, Photosphere, all that good stuff. And also you do get the late, um, the regular AOSB camera here too. Ah. Okay, that one's not working. So just don't use that one. Just use Google camera and you should be all good to go. Ah. And replace it with Google camera, uh, which is better anyways. Um, other than that, very nice ROM. I really love uh, Beanstalk since the days of 4.4. 2.2, I think, uh, but the latest version, um, looking good. It is only available right now for GTI 9100, um, which is good if you do have a GTI 9100. This is probably one of the best ROMs you can run on your phone, so definitely check it out for this week's ROM of the Week, and do let me know what you think. And as always, if you have a Galaxy S4, don't forget to subscribe to my email list at galaxys4root.com. Thank you.